Whisper Gaming ASMR. And if you're new here, I just want to let you know that I upload two versions of all my videos. One with Quiet Game Audio and one without. So, if you'd like to watch the other version, it is linked at the top of the video description below. But with that out of the way, today we are back in Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. And in one of my previous videos, someone said they'd like to see me play a puzzle game, which I did play a Pokemon puzzle game for one episode, but this isn't exactly a puzzle game, but I have uncovered seven or eight shrines, and my idea is basically to just have a few episodes where I only do shrines, so I've been saving them up, and I'm gonna do two or three, in theory, this video. We'll see, I want to keep it between 20 and 30 minutes, so maybe we'll only get one if I really struggle with these shrines. Okay, let's see, it says aid from above. Do I just jump over this laser? Let's find out. Okay. We're off to a good start. Now we have, okay, I was going to say we have two lasers, but we have significantly more lasers now. Let's see, can I move this? I cannot, but I can go underneath. And then I can climb up here. Assuming I need to ascend through this platform. Do I have to stop it to... Oh, hitting the B button. As you may have seen in my other videos, I recently got an ROG Ally handheld. So I've been going back and forth between playing Zelda and playing games on that. So I'm back to getting the A and B buttons switched up. I have no idea why Nintendo thought it was a good idea to swap where the A and B buttons are compared to um, other, other game controllers. It really messes me up. Okay. was close to me falling down there. Uh, oh, nice. Let's see if we get something good. A spicy elixir. I could use a bow. My bow selection right now is not very good. And I also have the analog sticks back. I keep meaning to crouch and I bring up the scope. It's weird. I was just playing Zelda in handheld mode for a while. And I wasn't making these mistakes, but as soon as I switch to the Pro Controller, I feel like I get everything all mixed up. Okay. it? No, but okay, at least this buys me some time. Um, what would I do here? I can't crouch. I can't jump. Oh, ascend to the top right before it hits me. Okay, I'm impressed. 
impressed that I used my how I used my abilities right there. Didn't even mean to stop time with that, but that worked out really well. Nice.
much mostly focusing on exploring and surviving. Because with these shaders, the world just looks so pretty, I mostly just want to explore. And I feel like the initial parts of base building and stuff is pretty boring. Especially how I do it, since I'm not, like, super advanced in Minecraft. I build pretty basic bases, now not to build farms or anything. So I think just running around and trying to survive might be more entertaining to watch. So keep an eye out for those videos. I don't know when I'll have time to record and edit those, but they should be coming semi-soon. Ish. I'm not sure when this will upload, but I'm recording this right at the end of June. And I'm about to be traveling to see some family the week of the 4th of July, so I'm not really going to be able to record during that time. So, um, it'll probably be... Oh, oh no! Oh crap, do I just let myself die? I think I'll go back to where I last landed. Let's see how this works. Ah, oh, crap. I'm gonna start all the way back here. Okay. Gotta be more careful with my landings, I guess. But, yeah, I'm excited to go home and visit my family. It's been... Let's see... Last time I went home was in March. So, that was... Okay, oh Jesus. Oh, uh, crap. Oh, I think... I need to shoot that thing before I move over there. So I haven't been home in three or four months. So I'm excited for that hang out with some friends, get to hang out with my family. My birthday was a couple weeks ago, so I'm going to be selling, celebrating that with my family. So my mom's a really good baker. She's going to make me one of her homemade cakes, which I always look forward to, so well, that's exciting. And it'll be nice to mostly have a week off from work. I've mentioned before, but I'm in sales, which is kind of stressful, especially with how the economy's going. Not many people want to buy stuff right now, so I'm going to be doing a little work from home, but the week of the 4th, most people take off from work anyway, so the people I'm selling to are on vacation, so I should be able to take most of the week off and not have to work too hard. So I'm excited for that. Also realizing how much I say yeah and so in these videos. I hope that that doesn't drive you crazy. And probably me pointing that out is going to make it way more noticeable, so... I'm not sure why I did that. Okay, these... These shrines aren't taking as long as I thought they would. We can definitely fit a third one into this video, I think. Now I can go upgrade. 
I've really not gotten very far in this game. I have not upgraded my battery at all. And I have not upgraded my stamina. And I'm only at six hearts. And I think I've only only got two or three inventory slot upgrades as well. So there's still a lot for me to do in this game. Okay, third shrine, let's go. More than defense. What does that mean? He's gonna attack me with a flame shield, oh crap. Oh Jesus. missiles. sure this only works once though.
right around the 20 minute mark, we completed our third shrine. It's almost like I planned it. Well, I think this is where I will leave you. I hope you found this video entertaining, and more importantly, I hope you found it relaxing. If you're trying to fall asleep, I hope you're not hearing this. But if you are, just relax, and you'll be asleep soon. If you'd like to watch more, a few other videos will be popping up on the screen right around now, so feel free to check those out. But I really appreciate you spending your time with me, and I hope you will come back for the next one. And as always, good night and goodbye.